and we back, and we back, and we back, and we back. Hey, sous chefs. And I'm back with another video for y'all. All right, you guys, we're back. We're back, we're back in full effect. We're back like we never left. First things first, you guys know what we do here on Sue Chef, and if you don't know, you're about to know. First, we take care of the business, and then we get to the fun. So if this is your first time here on Sue Chef, I wanna say, welcome. If you've been here before, I wanna say, welcome on back, y'all. I wanna ask that if you enjoy your time here, that you hit that subscribe button, you know, right next to it, there's a little bell, we call that post notifications here on YouTube. Click it and make sure you hit all so that you can be informed when all of my videos post, whether it's on a regular day or I'm posting a little bit more often than usual. Last but certainly not least, I want to ask that you guys leave me a lot of comments down in the comment section. I love the comments. I read all the comments. And also while you're here, make sure that you give this video a thumbs up. Now it's time for the fun. You guys, I am so excited to eat with y'all. Because today, I've been seeing everybody doing this lobster tail challenge. 12 lobster tails, a delicious buttery sauce, and no paper towels. I was like, easy. Easy. Because I got a big bottom lip. And my tongue is too big for my mouth. Let's just be honest. That's why you probably hear a little bit of a lisp. But... So I decided to accept this challenge, even though nobody actually challenged me. And I'm going to tag Flavors by Dame Dash. So I hope that y'all like this video. Um, so I'm going to do a little bit of a couple of different things. I'm going to have been craving some fried lobster tails. So I'm going to fry some. And then I'm just going to put some right on my um, electric griddle. Today, y'all, we are eating 12 lobster tails, delicious sauce, no napkins until we're done. This is a don't wipe your mouth challenge. So, if you ready, then I'm ready. Let's go, let's go. All right, so the easiest way to take these down is uh, starting here, grabbing a lobster tail. We have our lobster tail. Like I said, you're gonna insert your, not your scissors right in the middle and just scoot them back. Cut all the way to the fin. When you're doing that, you're actually splitting the meat in such a way that you can reach in and clean it. See that? We're gonna pull those out of every single one of these lobsters. You don't wanna eat lobster poop. I'll be back when they're done. And we back, and we back, and we back, and we back. fry some of these lobster tails and I just take it like this dump it here roll it this is literally just a mixture of flour and cornmeal that's it no added seasoning or anything like that okay there's one Let's get these lobster tails in the fire. Okay, so griddle. I have a very hot griddle here. Um, I already showed you guys that I fried a couple of them. So those are good to go. We're just gonna cook these other eight up right here. So let's begin. So I want the whole thing to be cooked. Eight lobster tails on the griddle. 
I made some garlic butter with that carry gold, carry gold. Honestly, it's gonna drizzle it on top. With another video for y'all all right you guys we did that so before we get into all of this food and this don't wipe your mouth challenge there's a couple things we got to do first we got to give all glory and honor to god for giving us the ability to move our hands and move our feet and move our lips to be able to create meals like this always and forever i give glory to god and I am so excited to give you guys this food is hot and I'm ready to dig in. Y'all ready to sing our theme song? But there's one more thing that we have to do. Ready? We have to drop a beat. Kick off your shoes is a sous chef beat. Gather around cause it's time to eat. We cooked it, we cooked it. We did that. Kick off your shoes. It's a sous chef beat. Gather around because it's time to eat. We cooked it. We cooked it. We did that. Let's eat, sous chefs. All right. So as you can see, I got my sauce here. I got my limes. Lime juice, salt, and pepper sauce. Thumbnail. Oh, spilled on myself. I'm gonna use my napkin for the last time in this video. Hopefully, I just have to not wipe my mouth. It didn't say what not wipe your cutting board. And I got some carry gold garlic butter. Now. I made four fried lobster tails and I have eight like grilled, yeah, griddled lobster tails. This is my sauce. I made it myself. So let's eat. Where do I start? I'm going to start with the fry because I feel like um, that's going to be the one that doesn't taste good when it's cold. Number one, I'm just gonna try it as is. Mm. We did that all. Nicely seasoned. That's normally my issue when it comes to lobster. It normally doesn't get seasoned well. I got my siren girl with me. I'm out of water. Yeah. Let's knock out these fried ones first. Because these I can tell are already going to take up Ooh. <clears throat> a lot of room. Mm. That's a shell. Ooh, that's hot. Is that one not so hot? This one is not as hot. I took two out before the other two. Mm -hmm. Am I ready? I'm gonna move my butter here so the metal can be my drip zone. I got a big bottom lip though, y'all. Mm. Not that big. Kind of irritating. 
come to cell number three. Try it in my. Oh, mm. mm -hmm. lobster and lime juice. So good. And really hot. Number four. This one really hot too, so I'm gonna come back to it. <laughs> Try this with the garlic butter. I season it with the garlic butter, so I'm sure it already tastes good. Mm -hmm. Got one drip in here. Lobster makes a funny noise when you eat it. I don't know if anybody else feels that way. It's all. And that looks really funny with this stuff dripping down my face. Number five. Drip zone. Mm hmm. All oh, look. Good sauce. Six. Ooh, I should eat some kimchi first. It's like being at a Korean barbecue. The more kimchi you eat. The more food you can eat. There's some lime juice on here. Mm-mm. Mm-mm. I'm not gonna make it, y'all. I feel myself. Mm-mm. Ooh. And I'm getting full. I only ate half of them. Alright. Need this last fried one. And then I'm done, you guys. I can't. I thought that my bottom lip and my tongue. That's too big for my mouth was gonna help me a lot in this, but <sighs> doesn't look that way. Twelve lobster cell mukbang. Hmm. Mm. It's so good though. Shout out to Cuzzo AB. She put me on to fried lobster tail and I've been craving it. Mm. And I saw this challenge was out. I was like, okay, bet. I should have waited to fry them. Made me fool. Mm -hmm. All right, you guys. <laughs> Time to wipe my mouth.
I saw Tay from Tay and Lou eat like eight lobster toes. And I thought for sure I could do that. Nope. I got seven though. I got seven though. All right, see Chef Fam. Thanks for checking me out. Lobster was amazing. Stay tuned. <laughs> With the rest of this, I'll probably make this a really dope dish um, that I love called Lobster Linguini. Hubby loves Lobster Linguini. A quick little Sunday video for y'all. Hope you guys have an amazing week. And I just want to ask you guys to do a couple of things before you leave me here at this table because I'm going to eat one more. <laughs> First of all, if you guys enjoyed the content, don't forget to give it a thumbs up. If you haven't yet, hit that subscribe button. Make sure you make it turn gray. That way you can always be here every time that sous chef drops a video. Last but not least, leave me some comments down below. If you think that I could have ate more lobsters if I hadn't, fried them and also let me know if you even like lobster tails because what i found i really like the fried ones but <laughs> lately lobster ain't really been doing it for me so let me know what your favorite type of seafood is but until then i showed you guys how to make this all today and now i just expect one thing from you now you can go and make it yourself bye Hot Cheeto hands, hot Cheeto hands.